it's time for another episode of Wham Bam Security Cam. As always, we've got plenty of crazy clips from our submitters, as well as the announcement of the penultimate Wham Bam hoodie winner. Ubby's dad's van was parked on the street while a family walked past it in peace, unaware that the van was about to save them. According to our submitter, the vehicle that crashed into the Mercedes and the van was stolen, and the driver had been driving down residential streets at a high rate of speed. Thank God the van was parked where it would protect the pedestrians from injury. They might have been frightened, but not even the shattered glass caused them any harm. Ovi told us they were disappointed because they'd been planning on selling the van. Instead, it was totaled by this reckless driver. She also told us that when the driver got out of the vehicle, he was slurring his words and yelling at bystanders. Yeah, something tells me he was in no condition to be in the driver's seat, even if he hadn't stolen the SUV. Henry's car was parked on a hot sunny day when, all of a sudden, whoa! Did you see that? Henry told us that when he found this hole punched through his window, he thought someone had tried to break into his car. When he reviewed his security cam footage, he discovered something had actually broken out. He remembered he'd left a new can of deodorant spray on top of his gym bag. When temperatures that day exceeded 100 degrees Fahrenheit, the can exploded. Yikes! Thankfully, nobody was injured by the airborne antiperspirant. The real question is, how did Henry's car smell after this deodorant detonation? Jason's outgoing mail was sitting in his mailbox when a woman walked up, rang his doorbell, then just walked away. At least, that's what she wanted him to think. If you watch carefully, you can see her tuck his mail into her waistband. Pretty sneaky lady, but not sneaky enough. Jason told us she stole a check for his car payment, but he was able to cancel it within an hour of it being stolen. He also asked our viewers to help him identify this woman so she can be stopped from continuing to victimize others. If you have any information, email us and we'll forward it along. Soon after a package had been delivered to this submitter's house, an individual riding a bike just happened to be heading toward their front porch. From inside, the submitter's husband spotted the cyclist before remembering that the package was still outside. He quickly opened the door just as the guy stopped. For some unknown reason, the guy then left in a hurry. Get off my property and don't come back. We share our submitter's husband's sentiments and we're glad the cyclist didn't manage to steal anything. Julie's neighbors got a little too close to a light pole while driving by one day. The falling pole barely missed hitting her neighbor's house. Julie told us the pole was replaced the following day. John sent us this week's cute cam. Check out the beautiful red chin on this hummingbird. Hi. Does anyone know what kind of hummingbird this is? Comment below. The little guy must have mistaken John's doorbell camera for a flower. Here's another video from Julie. This time, her dog Excalibur, or Callie for short, was tied up while enjoying a dip in the kiddie pool. Julie told us she normally doesn't leash Callie in the yard, but a neighbor's dog had been trying to come over and visit, so she kept him leashed while she left for a moment. That strategy didn't account for the possibility of a neighbor walking by with their own dog. Julie told us that pole was kind of old anyway, but I'm not sure if that mattered. If Callie wants to go, Callie goes. Here's another video from Julie and Excalibur. True to his name, he was protecting his yard one day, keeping a watchful eye on a neighbor's cat. Apparently, the cat didn't notice him as it explored the area before coming across the street. Callie stood guard and everything was fine until the cat set paw in Callie's territory. The cat noped out of there in a flash and Excalibur enjoyed his victory. Wow, another one from Julie? She's basically fueling this whole channel at this point. Well, that just means she has a lot of chances to win the one remaining Wham Bam hoodie, after this week's winner, of course. Stick around to see who it is. A pickup driver parked next to a dumpster before the occupants sat there for a while. 
they finally left on foot toward some unoccupied commercial buildings on the other side of the fence. Notice they're empty-handed. You'll see why that matters in a moment. About 20 minutes later, some movement can be seen behind the fence. Take a look at what they had when they made their way back to the pickup. Now, where did all that stuff come from? We're not making any accusations, but this all just seems a little sus. What do you think? While you're telling us your theory, we'll tell you that the winner of this week's hoodie giveaway is Spectrum, who sent us this video featured in episode 14. Congrats! We're only giving one more away, so send in your videos using the link in the description. Every video we feature is another chance to win. While Mario was at work, he began getting notifications from his security cams. When he reviewed the footage, he found a dog playing tag with some police officers. Looks like he's too fast for the fuzz. It seems the dog's friend had already been secured by the officers, but he wasn't willing to be captured so easily. Mario doesn't know what happened in the end, but we're guessing the dogs had escaped their owners and hope they found their way back. If the police ever managed to get a hold of the Flash, that is. Welcome back to Wham Bam Julie Cam. We had to show you one more of her videos, this time of someone stealing a very special plant out of her neighbor's backyard. I mean, I guess that's one way to get your fix. Just take a whole plant home. The neighbor thinks someone he'd hired to install security cams for him might have been behind the theft. You'd think getting security cams would protect you against theft, not encourage it. The neighbor told Julie that the cameras suspiciously malfunctioned during the theft. Hmm. Remember, you only have one more week to enter the hoodie giveaway. We can't wait to see your videos. Wham! Bam! We got a Patreon man! Please support the show!